Hey guys, so today we are going to be comparing numbers and we are going to be using the symbols greater than, less than and equal to. First of all, let me introduce you to our three symbols we are going to be using today. This guy over here is greater than. Then we have less than and equal to. We use these when comparing two numbers and their quantities. There is a super easy trick to know when to use greater than and less than and to turn those arrows around. The clue is to pretend that they are the jaws of a big, giant, hungry crocodile. Now this crocodile is extremely hungry. Do you think he's going to go for the number that is bigger or smaller? Hmm. Yeah, he's going to go for the biggest number because he's a very hungry crocodile. Duh. If the larger number is on this side, you turn his mouth to face the bigger number, ready to snap it. If the larger number is on this side, where well, you're going to turn his jaws to this side to snap. It's kind of that easy. Should we have a go? If I have three bananas on this side and two pears on this side, which is the larger number? Three is on this side and two is on this side. Hmm. You got it. Three is the larger number. So which way are the crocodile jaws going to face? This way. Towards the three. So when we say this, we say three is greater than two. And we use the greater than symbol. Well done. Let's have another go. Hmm. This time I have... Three chocolate bars on this side. Oh, and five chocolate bars on this side. Mm -hmm. Which side is the crocodile going to eat? Three on this side, five on this side. Which is the larger number or the greatest number? It's five. So the crocodile's mouth is going to face towards the five. Great work. Now when we say this, remember we start on this side, so we're going to say three is less than five because it's a smaller number. Three is less than five. And we use the less than symbol, which means the crocodile has turned away from the three and he's trying to eat the five. You're getting really good at this. Let's try one more. I have Four sandwiches on this side, and four sandwiches on this side. Which side has the greater number? Hmm. Can you guess which side the crocodile is going to eat? Hmm. Four on this side, and four on this side. Remember at the beginning I showed you the greater than, less than, and equal to sign. So when it's equal or the same amount, we use the equal sign because four is equal to, well, four. Well done, friends. Now it's your turn. I would like you to compare two numbers using the greater than, less than, or equal to sign. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. See you soon.